You open the trunk. Hey everybody and welcome back to another video of Getting Schooled. Today we're in the forest, we got a nice river in front of me right now and I'm hoping to get some trout. Either maybe bull trout, rainbow trout, maybe even a late coho. Last year I was up here we were hooking coho on beads in December which is crazy. I'm really amped up to get out here. I haven't been out in a while. We got a beautiful day, the rain has stopped. Some cloudy but it's all good. We got, uh, we got some good fishing times ahead of us. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video and hope we catch some fish. So stay tuned for more to come. Here we go. Fish on. That thing shot the float down so hard. Oh man, that thing went, shot it down so hard. Nice rainbow. Beauty rainbow. That thing took it down so hard. Oh man. I'm gonna try to bring it in over here. Nah, this is crazy. That's awesome. I was like short floating it kind of, I just went shooting right down. It's a chunker. That thing's so fat. Oh, that thing's a football. Oh yeah, look at that little chunker. Look at that fish, just a football. But I got my camera. Look how fat this thing is. That thing's so chunky. Look at the stomach. <laughs> just been gorging himself on eggs. Just a chunker. That is sick. Look at that chunker. Absolute gorgeous fish. Just hammered that bead. Just so fat, like look at that. I don't know how the camera's picking that up, but that's a fat fish. Like look at its head and then look at its belly. Just a fatty, filled with eggs. So we're gonna get this guy unhooked here. Single barbless hook, pops right out. Get one last look at him. Look at that fish. Beautiful. See you later. There he goes. Right on, man, that is awesome. That made my day. See if we can get some more, stay tuned. Kinda came out here late, so we don't have, don't have that much time. It gets dark so early now. I'm gonna try up here. See if there's anything chilling in a little bit shallower water stuff. Oh, it's just tough maneuvers. Oh. All right, let's give this a go. All righty here. Try that. Hopefully the float wants to drop. Dust is hooked up again. Hooked up. I don't know what it is. No, I just lost it. Frick, that was huge. Crap. Frick. That was massive. Holy crap. Frick! It was huge. Like that? That's the one I wanted. 
Shite. That was probably one of the biggest bulls I've ever hooked in here. Frick. No way. It was, no, it was massive. I set the hook, I thought it felt like a salmon. I couldn't move it. Yeah. Yeah. Frick. That's the exact same spot Dylan hooked his monster last year. I literally couldn't turn it around when it went for a run. Like, I honestly thought I snagged a chum or something in there. It was that, like, it was dogging me so hard. You saw it, eh? It was a bull. That's like that steelhead I lost a couple years ago, right in front of Marcus. Same sort of thing. Well, I'm tying up right now. Uh, snapped off. Pretty much first cast, so. Um, I'm in the car. I'm staying warm, warming up. And I'm tying up my leader. Snapped off everything, which sucks. But heard some hooting and hollering out there. So I'm going to see if they got a fish. So let's switch it to Cody's camera. Bizanzo Beans is hooked up here. Could be a rainbow. It's flying out of the water. <laughs> what do you got here? I think it's a white fish. Get that on the far side? Yeah. What? It's in some thick current though. Rainbow. Go. This is my rainbow. There it is. That's a nice chunker right there on the bead. Uh, that was a good little fight over there. I thought it was a whitefish. Had some big head shakes. Came flying four feet out of the water and like hit the main current. But it was a good fight overall. I got my light rod on. I'm glad I got one today in this high water. Um, it was a good time. There it is. Another look at this gorgeous fish. Oh. Let's let this guy on his way. There he goes. There he goes.